teams back on the ice are lined up, and period number two is about ready to go. Colorado's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. Oh, what a chance! He came so close to putting it in. James, I thought he had that one. If he continues to get to the net for that quick release shot, he's going to convert at some point in this game. Man, has he ever been dangerous tonight? He's got two goals, and he's looking for his third. Latang stick handling in his own zone. Oh, textbook hook check to turn that over. Both teams back to even strength, and after giving up a shorthanded goal, it's an opportunity the power play unit would probably sooner forget. The expectation when you're on a power play is to score a goal, not give up one, James. This is a tough one to take for this group. momentum after that equalizer. They seem to be moving a lot better as well as executing with the puck and that's something that is critical as they move through this game and it's a reason why they got the equalizer. Colorado's come up with possession after that neutral zone draw. Moves the puck along the half wall. Finds some space in the corner. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. Getzel's got it against the boards. The Avs gain control of the puck. McKinnon's got it in the defensive end. Slap up, slap up. Goes right to the crease. Big save. Well, he's flashing the leather on this save. The shooter's in a great A scoring area, and man, he just whips out the glove and makes the save. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. It's all tied up. Johansson's won the face off, and now let's see what they can do. And the deadlock is broken as they take the lead. Well, that's a huge shift. You can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. Not only did this one surprise the goaltender, it also surprised me from this long-range distance, James. Yes, the old Adan just put it to the net and good things can happen. The Avs, through their hard work and tenacity, have taken a one-goal lead here in the second. It's certainly better to play with the lead, James, but you know that there's a lot of one way left, and your opponent is going to come pushing and pressing. This game has been tight all the way around, and I expect that it will continue to be. Quick pass to Raquel. Handles the puck. The Penguins take it from the side. Oh, and he just got enough of that one to keep it out. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Here's a chance! Oh, just wide! You gotta get a shot. He scores! There it is! He just turned 30 pounder! Uh, he certainly did, and his name goes up in the upper echelon of natural goal scorers. He's shown it this entire season. He's been consistent. This is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. Colorado's now caught up by two in the back half of the second, and this is a nice place to be right now here in front. Exactly where they want to be. It's exactly how they would have written it up, but they've been dominating possession, and when you have the puck, the other team doesn't, and they've been rewarded with a couple of goals. Return pass. Johansson's got the puck. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Here he is in front. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Puck picked up by Pedersen. And they continue to apply pressure here. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. 
The Penguins cross the blue line and are on the attack. Puts it on net, and the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Georgiev's got to reset mentally and find his game here. I mean, his team's playing really well in front of him. It's a reason why they have the lead. It certainly hasn't been for his efforts between the pipe, but that save has to give him some confidence. He needs to settle in and start making more. And he gets in the lane to block that. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Quick shot! Puck grabbed by Drouin. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. From the slot, wrist shot, big time stop. Here he is, wrist it on net, denies him! And he'll hang on to the puck for a much needed whistle. Well, and this is huge change. He's ready to slow the game down, get a line change. There's no hot field in the coach right now. They'll be looking to keep that momentum going here in the face off. After that last shift change where they really fast, they want to continue right there, get pucks to the net because this goaltender will not want to battle net. He scores! There's the hat trick and let it rain Chapeau! Yeah, rain Chapeau is right there. Hats all over the ice. They're going to have to collect the ball. This is going to take some time, but man, has he ever had an effective night? He had two and he was thinking three all the way. I love that he took this long range, Mr. James. Often athletes will look to make a play closer to the net. He likes to just put it there and he finds the back of it. Colorado's probably thinking right now, let's just skip the intermission and keep playing the way things are going here, Cheryl. 100%, James. Anytime you have a healthy lead, everyone's playing well and contributing. You don't want it to stop. You don't want to go and sit and wait to come back on the ice. The Avs will take it behind the net. Takes a shot. Denied by the goaltender. Well, all those tracking exercises when you're young come in handy when you're older, and this is a prime example. Look at him, Bob and Weave, trying to find that puck. He does and makes a save. They're going to chance to make something happen here on the delay penalty. Extra attackers out. 40 minutes of play in the books. Both teams will get one 